Gang. Good morning. How you doing? I'm fucking great. Um, pretty productive morning. Was up and out of bed by 4.10. Got the solar panel cleared off. We're really running a little low on battery since we ain't been driving. But I went and checked because I, I started the van to get uh, some charge into that sucker. My battery to battery charger ain't fucking working. It is, but not really. It's supposed to be able to push like 30, 40 amps from the van to these batteries. Now, we might be getting like five. Um, so that's exciting. That's cool. Van life, it's just like a fucking house. Something's always wrong. Always. Always. Except... Usually, well, at least in my case, I ain't got fucking nowhere else to go. <laughs> uh, and I'm not, like, griping at them, but, like, some van people, especially online or whatever, like, they have a house. You know, they just choose to maybe rent it, use it as an investment property, which, like, good on you. Um, and, I mean, not like they'd have, not like they could go back to that. I mean, they'd have to probably cause a huge ruckus with, you know, terminating the lease and going to court and blah, 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 blah. Uh, but anyways, something's always wrong. Always, always. Whether something needs fixing in here or it's out of adjustment because you drive and it's like this thing's in an earthquake every day. Um, yeah. But, um, you know, kind of, I don't know. It's all right. Figure it out. Gotten this far, you know. It's not what I actually wanted to talk about today, though. Um, eh, a little bit. Stuff you don't think about. I think I did one of these. I didn't need to fill my oil yesterday. Um, run, run a little low. Grabbed the oil. Went to fill it up. Nothing came out. It's kind of a dark bottle, you know, the dark green sea glass type thing. Um, I looked in there, nothing's moving. Uh, I don't keep the van like cold per se, but I don't keep it like exactly like the warmest either. Um, like, I usually keep it on like 55. It's cool. I like wearing hoodies. Like just out of habit type thing. Um, it's not like I can't crank the heat. Like I got the diesel furnace and right now I'm at a campsite where I can plug in the heat. So like really like there's no reason for me not to keep it higher. But I'm just used to it and I like it and it's good to go. Well, I'd even argue that if I had the heat higher because of where you got to store things in here. Um... I'm realizing I'm doing this all out of frame, which I probably shouldn't be doing this. I don't I don't need to show you filling my oil container, but now it's kind of too late and I need to concentrate. I totally should do this over the sink because there's many times that I've spilt it. Um, where's it going with this? Oh, because of where I store it. I store it under the sink. Um, just kind of like way in the back. There you go, gotta move one thing to get to another thing. Not a big deal, just saying. Whoa, relax. Um, yeah, like you don't think of that stuff, man. You really don't. Uh, like store, like storage is a huge thing, and it's kind of got me not weirded out, but uh, I mean, I'll talk politics all day. I ain't fucking scared of it. Um, with the bullshit that's going on right now, 
it's about to get a lot worse. Like, a lot worse. So, like, shortages and stuff are about to be, like, bad. Like, crippling. Um, like, food chain, all that kind of stuff is, like, that's going to be bad. That's my prediction. Um, from hearing some other people talk about it, doing a little bit of research, being like, oh, well, why would that be affected? Oh, wait. Okay. Um, yeah, all right. The fact that the U.S. actually pays farmers to not produce. Look into that. Check that out. It's always been a thing, like always, um, because of like market and whatnot. But uh, the amount at which it's done right now and in like the past year and a half, two years, which like check out where your oranges come from. Uh, and I don't mean like check out California, like. The oranges you get, they're old, especially if it's out of season. Like there's storage for these things. And like if you, you know, halt production, the, well, the storages, the storage levels go down. You know what I mean? Like it, it has to, cause you're not, you're not f fulfilling it. It's like your bank account. You know what I mean? You know, I know about that. Mm -hmm. You don't work and it dwindles and you're like, wow, this is weird. Like, why is it not going up? Like, this is weird. Uh, <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, check out in the last like year and a half, two years, how much the U.S. has paid farmers to not produce food. Um, not that we get all of our food from in the States anyways. Like, that's another fucking thing. When we totally could. Totally viable. Plenty of farmland. Like, I'm literally fucking sitting on a farm right now uh which does not produce anything anymore weird now and i don't know their backstory i don't know if they were bought out i don't know if they crumbled or whatever but uh they don't produce food anymore but they used to um sorry not food they used to produce uh tobacco which that's fine that can go away that's fine um, where is I go? Oh, storage. Um, so like, I don't have like an unlimited pantry, you know, I am going to and need to, uh, you know, dedicate space for that and reorganize because I'm gonna call me a prepper, call me fucking psycho, whatever. I'm going to stock up on some shit. I'm going to find some creative spots to store canned foods and canned goods. Cause yeah. Um, I don't have, you know, an unlimited supply. I don't have like, um, you know, a pantry that I've been stocking for years and rotating stuff in and out and blah, blah, blah. Um, yeah, it's kind of, it's kind of like, I don't want to say it's a worrisome thing, but it's definitely like an eye opener. Like, oh shit. Like, hmm. <laughs> I go to the grocery store once, if not twice a week, typically, because I just don't have you know, the, the storage for it. I eat a lot. That's an, another contributing factor. But, uh, yeah. Stuff you don't think about. <gasps> uh, the egg was not ready to flip. Whoops. We'll wait on the other one. Disappointment. Disappointment. That's another thing. Like, I don't have any other way to cook besides this. Which, like, I'm grateful for, I guess. Because this is at least, like, mobile. Like, they shut off your gas line at the house. Like, you fucked. Um. Oh, gosh. That one wasn't that ready, too. But I can't be having them like this. The other one's going to be, like, way overcooked. And then I shut it off because I was like, yeah, it'll cook enough. Nah, probably not because it wasn't ready. Ah, it's one of those mornings. Um, need to stock up on propane. There was, there was a point like right after Christmas, I, I, could, I didn't have any for a couple days. That sucked. It was like a day and a half. It wasn't the end of the world. It wasn't great. It's like, damn. I can't have hot food. That sucks. 
Um, And with the battery charger not freaking working, I need to sort that out. I need to email them. Find out, hey, like, what the crap's going on here, bud. Uh, and, dude, Kentucky. I'm not saying I don't like the place. Um, but, uh, man, they don't, they don't get, like, any sun. Like, ever. Ever. Like, I thought Alaska was bad. Especially in the winter, like, oh, it's dark all the time. No, like, because it's usually cold as fuck, which means it's sunny. Um, this in the winter. Um, the summer, yeah, it gets rainy and snotty and it's, like, annoying. But in the summer, when the sun's out, the sun's out. Like, it's out forever. Uh, <clears throat> I haven't been getting that much solar out of the panel. It snowed again last night. Another another day not driving. Did I tell you guys I'm not driving the van? Like, I haven't driven the van in like three days. I'm gonna ride for Ben. I think I said that. I don't know. Uh, yeah. And it doesn't matter whether the engine's like under a load or not to power that because it's a DC to DC charger, so it purely just takes out of that battery to feed these batteries. So it doesn't matter whether I'm driving or not to get, you know, uh, to get power out of it, I guess is what I'm trying to say. Um, so that's that's not the issue of it, like not charging, you know, because I, I had the van idling just to get some charge in it. And it's like three, four amps, like sweet. Well, if the lights are on and my little fan's on real low, and say the water pump's on, well, I'm gaining nothing. I'm not losing anything, which is okay, I guess, you know. That's that's all right. If I'm not losing, cool. But I ain't gaining. And, I mean, I bought, I bought the thing to freaking fill up my fucking batteries. And it's not even that old. And I don't even use it that much. Like, it's usually off. Like, yeah. My whole road trip, the thing was off. The thing's been off since I left Alaska. Like, I, I only turned it on since I've been here in Kentucky, which is a month and a half. And even then, it was off all summer in Alaska, too. It shouldn't be broken. Like, it should not be malfunctioning. I don't really... There was a topic, but there wasn't. This was just a rant. I haven't sipped any coffee yet. Good stuff. Good stuff. That's it. Not going to waste your time. Cheers.